What's going on, everybody? Beastly Gamer here. I wanted to talk to you guys about the future of The Last of Us. Now, we've all talked about potential sequels. They may or may not be in the way, and I'm pretty sure we'll get a remake. But one thing that I do know is that they are making a Last of Us movie. That's right, guys. For those Last of Us fans, Sony has announced that they are creating a, a film adaptation of the game. Now, when I first heard this news, I got extremely upset. I didn't show it to anybody. But I have, I'm 34 years old. I got pretty much a history of watching video game adaptations into film flop, and it's terrible. It's, especially when you love a franchise. Like I used to love Resident Evil, and I still do. I love the originals, one, two, three, four. Those are my favorites. And uh, when I saw the Resident Evil movies come out, and they completely shit all over the canon with this Alice character who was superhuman and all this crap. I just felt like the, the writers and the directors had no respect for the gamers who, who fell in love with the original canon. And so when I see these kind of films come out, uh, Tomb Raider, I mean, when you see these movies uh, and you see the history of it, you immediately get a bad taste in your mouth thinking, oh God, they're about to destroy something that I, I hold so dear. But this may not be the case with The Last of Us, and I'm going to tell you guys why. This article is on GameSpot.com. Let's keep our fingers crossed and remain optimistic. This might end up being worth our while. The Last of Us was praised for its strong story, and now the PlayStation 3 action game is getting a movie adaptation. Before you shrug your shoulders or roll your eyes, consider the talent behind the project. Naughty Dog creative, directive, creative director Neil Druckmann will write the script for the film, according to Deadline's exclusive story. And Naughty Dog co-presidents Evan Wells and Christoph Balestra, as well as game director Bruce Streely, are also involved. Veteran Naughty Dog writer Amy Hennig recently left the company, though it's unknown if she'll contribute to the film. Now, that's a story I haven't covered yet. It'll probably be coming out real soon. But she did. She was forced out of Naughty Dog by the, the writers of The Last of Us. Now, she's been involved with all the uh, Uncharted games. She's a very talented video game developer. And uh, she was forced out of a company she helped build up. I don't like that too much, and I still I, I don't care if it's the last of his team that forced her out. She she should be respected, and her opinion should be respected. I wonder if it had anything to do with them bringing this film to this video game to film. The movie will be distributed by Sony's own Screen Gems production company. Deadline also notes that Spider-Man director Sam Raimi and his Ghost House Pictures company are attached to the project. Raimi's involvement with the with this project is unclear. Since our game released last June, we're talking with many companies about making a film. But we couldn't have found better partners who share our creative vision and high standards, well said about Screen Gems and Ghost House Pictures. No other details about casting or plots for The Last of Us movie were announced, so we have to ask, who do you think will be a best cast for Ellie and Joel? I have to say Ellen Page for Ellie because Ellie was designed with Ellen Page's likeness. and. If we could get a younger Clint Eastwood, maybe, for Joel, but nobody's coming to mind. You guys let me know who do you think would be good cast as Ellie and Joel. Now, the fact that they actually have the writers of The Last of Us writing this script, I don't even know if Ellie and Joel will be in this movie. Because that's kind of the reason they don't want to make a Last of Us Part 2. They don't want to screw up the canon. So, think about that. If, they, if they're not willing to make a Part 2 because the story is complete... What are the chances of them making a film adaptation with these characters unless it's a frame-for-frame -frame remake of the game we've already played? So I don't know if that will be the case. You guys let me know what you think about this. Is this good news, bad news? Uh, who do you think would be best suited for these roles? And also tell me what do you think is your worst video game to film adaptation ever? There are a lot of them. It's a huge list. You guys let me know. I think probably Super Mario 1993. It's a movie that I watched just for gags. It's absolute horse shit. Me and my wife sit and watch it from time to time just to realize how bad it is. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.